Hi Sumer, this is Iki from the Somnex and today I'm going to be teaching you how to play Reminiscency on the acoustic guitar. Our usual camera is broken right now so I'm going to be filming on my phone. Hopefully the quality is still there. Thank you guys so much for listening to Reminiscency and all our other songs from the Kuala Wata EP. We're very proud of how it turned out and uh, we hope you guys enjoy it as much as we enjoyed making it. All right, first things first, you need your capo on the third fret of your guitar. Reminiscency is in the key of B flat, but if you follow my previous tutorials, you guys would know that I like to play these set of chords. Uh, it's the chords, I mean, it's the chord shapes that I'm most comfortable with on acoustic guitar. So yeah, Reminiscency is in the key of B flat, but essentially you'll be playing the song in the shapes of G major, if that makes sense. I mean, that's what the key was for. So like, yeah, that should make sense. I don't know. Chords used in the verses and chorus are G major, B flat seven, E minor, and then D major. If you guys don't know how to play these chords, I'll put a chord chart on the screen right now. You guys can pause here and familiarize yourself with these chords. So for the acoustic version, usually Dan would play most of the rhythm stuff and I would just play on top of that. So yeah, maybe if I play and sing it and show you guys the whole guitar, you guys would get it. Usah kau menangis lagi Ku tahu yang kau sudah Coba segalanya Dan perkara yang paling sukar Ialah tu berupa Ui, Susah saya nyanyi Mungkin ini opsi terakhir buat kita berdua sentiasa melepaskan kenangan yang kita telah melalui tak sudah memanggil tunggu apa lagi so like yeah strumming wise or plucking wise I think you guys can experiment yourselves but yeah that's how i that's how i would play it i would say and like if you guys didn't catch that you guys can just repeat the video just like play along yeah yeah you got this you got this for the pre-chorus we're going to go to this c c chord without the index finger so that's c major seven it's actually pretty similar to pulang's pre-chorus so chords used are the C major seven and then this D. This one that I used for pulang as well. It's uh, okay basically it's uh, one, two, three, four, five. Your ring finger on the fifth fret of the fifth string, and then middle finger on the fourth fret of the fourth string, and then the rest just leave it open. And then it goes back to the C and then it goes to a B7. Yep. So it goes like The, the the chorus is the same as the verse chords used are the same it's just how you play it okay i'll show you how we play the pre-chorus and chorus together
clearly you can tell that I even I don't know how the strumming goes I just play according to how I sing it and uh, yeah you guys can try mess around I mean if if I if I wasn't singing I guess I would strum it like this sense man i suck the bridge of the song is the same eh we don't have a bridge we don't have a bridge we have guitar solo all right yolo guitar solo on acoustic how would i play it i'll play it like this shit one two three four five six seven so this is gonna be the first note of the solo and we're gonna slide from here all the way up here yeah they got you i think you guys can like figure this out yourselves so i'm just gonna play it next we're gonna go here so from here then we're gonna go down here I really don't know how to teach guitar solos, but let's see what we got so far. Oh, that's a new one. From here. Open. Go to the second fret of the fourth string. This next part uses the fourth and third string. Yep, then you just repeat that one more time. I like to add some harmonies for the next part. This is the next one. Yeah, I think we've spent enough time on that. If you guys really want to learn the solo, just repeat that. I'm sure you guys got it. I'm sure you guys can pick apart the notes yourselves. Other than that, I think we're done. I think that should cover the whole song. Um, verse and chorus use the same version. And uh, we went through the pre-chorus and we didn't have a bridge. We have guitar solo. And yes, the guitar solo is inspired from that one episode of Phineas and Ferb. Yeah, I think that's about it. 
uh, if you guys have any issues with the song uh, please leave a comment below and I'll try to reply to your comments but like, yeah it's, it's a pretty simple song I'm sure you guys just need the chords you, you didn't need this tutorial but I decided to do it anyway so hope you guys enjoy it thank you so much for supporting us and listening to Kapal Batu EP and Emergency of course till next time I'm Iki from Insomniacs Good at you.